You see, gap, gap is a, is a, gap is a, is, is a statement political party. We are waking up the eyes. Oprosunya yele kabe janjang. That's Oprosunya yele kabe janjang is number two. Say it again, Oprosunya yele kabe janjang, meaning a positive mindset and good heart. When the positive minds and the good hearts are connected, these true eyes will see the truth and will accept the truth and will do the action. And action is the only credible response for success. You're talking about 200,000 already guaranteed. Guaranteed, inshallah. Recently, we've seen a very nasty video that came out from a woman attacking you. You see, my, my, my brother, my brother, you see, um, I respect you. Uh, when you talk, you, you, my interview with you and I is about, it's about our policies our visions that we have the country, not my executive uh, uh, personal life. But to no, Do you call that personal? Because yeah, it has gone very well. To me, you see, the most, the most abused human being, the most disrespected, they abuse him the most. They disrespect him the most, not the most. They disrespect him the most, they abuse him the most, and his name is being called the best all over. Do you know who's that? Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa So who's Bachili? When before you, you have been abused. I've been abused. My brother, the real I'm not here to tell what even they want they take me to CNN and Al Jazeera. You know what that means? Huh? That's so if I was not credible, if I was not a real man, they ain't gonna see no mad dog or a mad human being on the street trying to video him. And when you listen to the video, when you listen to the video, the statement uttered in the video, that means it's a setup. Oh, it's a setup. Uh, my brother, you and to listen to the media. For me, whatever they do, if they want, but Bachili, no one can put Bachili down, neither gap down. Bachili has been prescribed, ordained, prepared by Allah with gap. There's nobody who can put me down. And let me tell you, in politics, if you are, if you are scared to be talked about, quit the game. So Bachili, me, I'm, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like a uh, super kanja. <laughs> Come on, like <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> so everybody love Accra, and it's sweet. So for them to put this media to me, I have due respect for you. Otherwise, I don't want to talk about it. Let's not even talk about any executive error. I'm, I'm urging you, well, please. Let's close it up by you. You have to send a message to 200,000 fans, as you said okay. right now. Yeah. What will you have to tell them about that video? As you said, it's a setup. What message are you sending them? I'm telling. I'm, I'm telling those 200,000 plus. Pro, oh, plus. Yeah. 200,000 plus that in any leadership material. I have the leadership material. Gap have the leadership materials. I want you to listen. To, I have the leadership material. Gap has a lot of leadership materials. For us to succeed, you have to face a lot of obstacles. You cannot have the golden spoon or golden plate in your hand without facing obstacles, man. This is part of life. But whatever they're uttering against me is a mere, is a mere propaganda. It's a mere propaganda. For me, whatever they said, look at, I don't even respond. A leader, you have to observe everything, good and bad. And it's up to my viewers. Do not look at Bachili's errors. Look at the potentiality of Bachili and Gap that can put Gambia on the half map. We have quality leadership in, quality leadership material in, in, in Gap. So for me, people watching about video, everybody has bots. Everybody has bought, but this is not a bot, this is a setup. I'm not saying I'm, I'm, I'm a human being, I'm arrow, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not perfect. But the media type of say this is calling me names, all it's all rubbish. It's a setup trying to defame my character. And imagine if you're trying to defame a, a, a believer's character for us to be laughed at, you are, you are defaming yourself. And whoever does that, I have forgiven them. I have forgiven them. I even I went to court with one of them. Criminal court, I have a proven, he was, he, was, he was charged and we went to court and I have forgiven him. That's what we call a leadership court. I have proved, I called the prosecutor today in Cardiff that look, if I'm yearning, yearning for Gambian leadership, my party's yearning to rule Gambia in a positive way, why should I take somebody court, a criminal court against, against him because he do something wrong to me? That means when we empower, we'll do revenge. So I told him I've forgiven him. And then that's, a, that's us, that's God. We have leadership materials from Bachili to all. I can count more than 100 Bachilis in Gab, more confident than Bachili, in fact. They have all the leadership material from Khartoum to Wulimbana in Gambia and outside Gambia. So for us, this video, you see, in politics, it's a dirty game to certain people. If I was not a, a public figure, 
If I was not a public figure, I was a businessman. I'm still a businessman. Otherwise, it will never. I have done a lot of businesses all over the world. But the moment they see Bachil is a threat, the man with the vision, the party with the vision. Have you ever heard this party insulted anyone? No, not yet. Majority of the parties were insulted, definitely, except us. <laughs> we can count it. Neither two governments are there. <laughs> Neither two governments. Anyone who be insulting our polit political parties, insulted, definitely. No, we don't do it. We positively criticize. That's why I say Mr. President Barrow needs an advice, not a political manager from GAP. People are assuming that we're going to collide. Our doors are open. We work based on the reality and the interests of Gambia. No compromise. Let's come to let's come to about our healthcare system. That's what I was going to come up next. Uh, you listen, watching, of course, the CNG network uh, having this one-on-one -on -one exclusive with uh, the party leader of GAB, Mr. Bacheli. Um, uh, I was going to come to the health sector of the Gambia, but uh, before that, you are among the few, if not the second, I think, if I, if I stand to be corrected, but that talks about, you know, the illegalities that is happening in the, around the world. I'm talking about Palestine and Israel. You know, you came, you came out and, and publicly, you know, condemned it. I haven't seen it from the government, you know, um, but why were you concerned about this Palestine and uh, Israel thing? It's, it's a Palestine and Israel thing. It's not, about, it's not about being a Muslim. I love my religion. I love Muslims. I love Islam. I respect all the religions. Do respect to them. But Palestine and Israel thing is about humanity. The superpowers, United States, the EU, the European and United Nations, and Russia Federation. If this was a Muslim power, a Muslim country, like Iran, Saudi Arabia, Syria, Turkey, bombing people in, 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 in um, how you call it, um, how you call it, um, um, in Italy, Rome, Vatican. My man, it's going to be a serious problem. And they, they, would, they would not even call a story. They would call names that is more dangerous than even terrorists. Israel is supposed, they have to stop it. And I'm urging in the nation and the superpowers, if they believe in democracy and they said they believe in humanity, human violation, then they should tell Israel should be taken to ICC. The International Criminal Court should prosecute Mr. Benjamin Yahoo, Mr. Benjamin Netanyahu or Netanyahu. He should be prosecuted. But you know what? When you, when you see the corrupted institutions, and the corrupted government, they think they own this country. They call themselves reformers. What are they reforming? Looting people's resources. Like I said, look at the French. Look at the French. 14 countries of France, of African countries, are paying $500 billion per year to France. For what? My brother, for what? And whoever stands against that, they will kill you. Even Bachili, when we give him power, they, said they will try. They can't kill me. I'm already protected by God, the most high. So I'm telling you, Israel, Gaza Plaza is a barbaric situation. And Israel, remember, you might have power today. B -B B-52 against stones. That means who are the winners? The one with the stones. I respect Palestine. I'm, I'm fighting for the as human being. I'm not fighting because of religion. I love them, my Muslim brothers. I respect them. But this is against religion. This is against any religion. They know the Christian religion, uh, Muslim religion, and, 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 and uh, even Jewish. They are using the Zionists. They are using their powers, abusing. And America is saying that. Europeans are saying that. United Nations so called are saying that. The, 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 the how you call it, the, the Russia Federation are saying that. What they have done? For 11 to 15 days, I don't know, 16 days, just bombing in the month of Ramadan. Sad. It's a sad. sad. And look at, and that's why I urge our president, Mr. President Barrow, to call the whole Muslim communities in the whole world to talk about this issue seriously. I've not seen the Saudi Arabia talking. That's a big shame. A but when we're in power, we will, we will, when we're in power, we will negotiate until Palestine has its own freedom. Yeah. I saw the, 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 the step that Gambia took on Rohingya Muslims. I was expecting to see the same release. To, 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 you know, but that's, that's why I talk about it. I was the first person to talk about it. And it, 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 it catch the whole entire media. They know what I'm saying is the truth. It's barbaric. So Israel, I have respect for you guys. We're all human. Let's respect each other. It's a matter of respect and respect humanity. Allah says in the Quran, Lakat karamna bani Adam. I've hurt human beings. Allah never said I hurt Muslims. Muslim human beings? No, he's a herd human beings. And that human beings, you find Muslims there, Christians there, Jews there, you name it. If Allah, they create a herd us, respect us, 
love us, give us all kind of things. Who is Israel? Bombing people because of their interest and the whole superpowers are watching? Then I will call them terrorists. They are terrorizing the Gaza. Mr. Bashir, I will not end this interview without coming back home. Uh, finally, you know, before I leave you, um, a lot needs to be done, as you said. Uh, Barrow is uh, almost ending up his uh, first term um, in office, and he has every plans to go ahead. I think that seed is very sweet. When you tested, you want to continue. Uh, what message will you have for the current government, uh, for your fans, of course? And very important, we are in a, in a time that IEC have opened up voter registration, which is very important because many people want to take part in political discussion, but they don't even have a voter scan. Let's talk about that first of all. You know? Mr. C, I'm urging IEC to be neutral. I respect Bamar Chairman, Mamur Njai, is my uncle, but his team, I respect them. I want them to be neutral, fair and neutral. Let them be committed eh, and loyal to the nation. Fair and neutral, and I believe and I believe they will fear and neutral. And I'm urging Gambians, as far as you are 18 years old, come out, collect your, your constitutional right. That's called your B-52. Don't insult. Don't insult the president. Don't insult all the political parties or leaders. Whoever you want to be president, use your voter's card. And choose it rightly. If you want to choose Mr. C as your president, or Mr. Gab uh, as, as the next government, or, or, or the other political party next government, choose. But use that voter's card. That's your constitutional right. If you have your voter and you don't vote, you are violating your own constitutional right. And we, Gap led government, we are campaigning all of from Khartoum to Ulibana. Gambians, whoever is 18 above and you qualified, come. They ask for only four documents. Birth certificate, ID, passport, or attestation from Alcalo then go and use your voter's card. Don't make no noise. When the election come, gap next government, vote for them. All the political part that you choose is rather than we are going to televisions, we are going to medias insulting each other. It doesn't make sense. Sell your ideas, sell your manifestos, sell your, sell your visions to your country, men, so that they can listen to you in our language. I prefer speaking even Wolof when we're talking, or Maninka or Sarahule, for the viewers to understand. Yes, we can, we can do it, inshallah. But Barrow said three years, and now he has expanded to five years, and want to sit again for the next elections coming. No, um, are you not scared? I'm, I'm, I'm too scared. Gablet government? We are, we are warriors, man. <laughs> we are fighters. If he said three years, and the constitution said five years, from the get-go, remember I said to you, I believe in five years. And our party believe in five years. We follow the constitution with the supreme book of the, of the country. This was a gentleman, and if they, um, um, how you call, betray each other because of three years, huh? that's up to them. Now he has his own constitutional right to stay for five years. If he's ready to contest, let him. I heard one of um, a former foreign ambassador, a foreign, a foreign minister or foreign, um, a foreign secretary, come to Sidia Job. Yes. Sidia is saying that the president should not contest. To me, I'm not supporting the president. He has no right to tell the president that. You want him to contest? Let him contest. He believe in himself, and then the next government will be will be known. <laughs> What's your final message to the Gambian? My final message to the Gambian, I had to let's make sure peace and stability is the richest resources that we have, not our natural resources. We can have all kind of natural resources, and if we don't have peace and stability, my brother, the resources is 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 meaningless. Please. To be honest with you, it's too late to come out. Let me tell you the truth. What you, what, what? It was too late to come out. Ooh. They are misleading me. Yeah. A proactive leader, you don't compromise, you don't wait for time. When you see action, remember I said action is the only credible response. If it was government, government, yeah, subhanAllah, my brother. It's eye to eye. When, when you kill, we'll kill you. No, that's not in the constitution. Uh, listen to me. No, that's not in the constitution. No, no, they, they don't have their roof, they don't have their road in America. Yeah, we have their road in some states in America. In a, but, but this is Gambia. When, when you come, I'm not accidental killing like you driving manslaughter. I'm not, I want Gambians to listen to me proper. I'm not a manslaughter or you are fighting accidentally. We can take you to court, but intentionally go to robbery. You are fighting with me, you stab me. They will kill you immediately on government. government. But we set that example, one, two, three, four, five. Believe me, our peace will be okay. Stability will come. They will think twice. And we will CCTV all the whole entire nation. The whole entire nation will CCTV. The moment you sit, is, we have a security reserve, our national president, Mr. Jasse, he's well equipped in the system of security. 
Allah has you given. Want, you want to put CCTV in My brother, we will secure this country even if you leave your telephone in the market and you go, you come back, you made it there. It's a gap led government, we have all sect. Our leadership is fantastic. Ligebodi halat yep munuko. I'm the new security be, I'm the new economy be, I'm the new healthcare system be, I'm new agriculture be. Resources is Mr. Bajili. I will explore it, I will tell them they would, I'm the new leadership proactive. Chahaneku for who? The governing council come in, which is my, my role, the eagle eyes. We don't play. So this is the Ambassador National President. He went, he went to Fatu Network. He tell them about the policies that GAP will bring when it comes to security. When you come to healthcare system, there's poor people. I will tell you to interview them. When they come, the policies that we have. You think I'm ready government. We have ready government, ready to lead. And our presidential candidate, there are qualities, man. And now you see, look at the separation of powers. In the history of Gambia, somebody who is the founder of a political party, became a sector journalist. I'm not interested in the power. I'm watching, I'm grooming a leadership that can run and I've helped them. Which political party have done that in the Gambia history? Yeah? Wish you all the best uh, come December uh, 2021. Uh, come, 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 come January 20. January, 22. January, <laughs> January 20, is, is maybe it's going to be only 27 to be in power. At, after we, our election, it's about 30 days or 90 days or 45 days you know, when we win election. Come to January, we shake hand in the state house. Will you invite me at the state house? Oh, you, are you, you gonna be, you gonna be the press secretary. Oh no, <laughs> no, 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 not interested. You know why? You know not why? You know why? Yeah. Ask me. Yeah. I want Gambians, the youths, to control their own destiny. The Gambian youths. Yeah, to control their own destiny. There are uh, better press secretaries. But there is, me. but we, you know, there is no better. Mm. We groom. There's no better. We groom. I was groomed by my father, and I was groomed by intellects in the street, in the bureaucracy. So my knowledge that I have, I have to share with others. Well, I for you, take a rabbuka fatah, the one Allah give, you should be content. We are content. GAP is a content political party. We're not looking for election. We are looking for the generation to be, for the betterment of the generation. Mr. C, there's no joke about us. I'm repeating again, let my whole VOC be the wall. Inshallah, the next government is GAP. You know why? Action is the only credible response which we have. Whatever you heard about GAP, Gisnga Fu Buku Hama, all of Nine, Buku, Buki Su, Subote, Haji Nambode. Wow. No, that means. Exactly. That means success from you. For they got Chocho Rek, for plus success Veneka. Because Chocho is with GAP. Thank you very much, Mr. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 Thank you.